Again, China. You've got to understand that something serious is going on there. Something extraordinary has now happened. And even the world's top tennis players are scared. They're asking questions. Peng Shui is a Chinese player who won the doubles titles at Wimbledon and the Paris Open. But she has now gone missing in China for the past couple of weeks. And that happened after she accused one of China's top politicians, the Vice Premier, of raping her. And she posted on Weibo, that's China's version of Twitter, a long message saying, I know that someone of your eminence, Vice Premier Zheng Jiaolai, you'll say that you're not afraid. That afternoon, I didn't give my consent and couldn't stop crying. You brought me into your home and forced me and you to have relations. Well, Chinese censors quickly took the message off the internet. And they even censored discussions in China that even you know, mentioned tennis. Peng disappeared. Well, then the top male player in the world, Novak Djokovic, he spoke out. I don't have much information about it. I did hear about it uh, a week ago, and uh, it's honestly, it's shocking, you know, that, that she's missing. I mean, uh, uh, more so that it's someone that uh, I've seen on the tour in the previous years quite a few times. So, I mean, uh, there's not much more to say than, than hope that uh, she'll be found, that, uh, you know, that she's she's okay. And it's, it's, it's just, it's terrible that, um, you know, I can imagine just how her family feels, you know, that, that she's missing. Now, former women's champion Naomi Osaka, she's posted about the missing woman too, saying censorship is never OK at any cost. I hope Peng Shui and her family are safe and OK. I'm in shock of the current situation and I'm sending love and light her way. Where is Peng Shui? Now, it's important to... Remember, to be grateful too, these players are taking a professional risk. China is a massive market now for international sports. And you've seen people go to water trying to uh, keep their dollars flowing. You might even recall basketball superstar LeBron James. He shut his mouth rather than back democracy protests in Hong Kong. Even worse, James said, the Houston Rockets boss who did speak up for the protesters, he was misinformed. But more courage and more principle is being shown now in world tennis. The Women's Tennis Association has also raised concerns about Peng and got a strange email, which the Chinese state media then published, of course. And in it, Peng, allegedly, Peng, says, no, I'm not missing, nor am I safe. I've just been resting at home and everything's fine. And she went on to ask the W2A not to say anything about her without her permission. Well, the W2A boss isn't buying it. He said, I have a hard time believing that Peng Shui actually wrote the email we received. So where is she? Where is she? She accused one of China's leaders of rape. And now she's disappeared. This cannot stand. China is holding the Winter Olympics next year. I wonder, will the athletes there now make a stand for one of their own?